about their foreign problems of living in the U.S. So, um, so yeah. I think this one that you had about touching, I'm not going to give it away. Oh, I feel like people don't understand that it's part of our culture. Like in Russia, if you touch somebody mm -hmm. or in Turkey, it's normal. It's part of like, hi, how you doing? Oh, you look so cute. So yeah, that's totally fine, right? He's like, no. That's not what we do here. And I go, why? And I said, come on, if I, if I, I'm like, come on, if somebody, nobody ever told you like, hi, oh, you look so cute. Oh my gosh, he's so good. He's like, he did this and he goes like, see, that right there makes me feel like you want to have sex with me. Like that's, I already, <laughs> so I became like red and I'm like, really? It's um, not that, right? It's I like have stories about language issues because um, I really can't do a lot of slang phrases mm -hmm. coming from a gym in the elevator and this guy was like oh where are you coming from I'm like I'm coming from making out and from his look I was like uh I went to my husband I'm like isn't that like when you go to gym don't you say you make out he's like no you say <laughs> workout I'm like oh my, god. oh my god that's how I learned what a make out is it's so embarrassing because I thought I said workout another one is uh, I always say I cracked out so much because it's cracked out. It's like, like it. right now you're cracking out for me, <laughs> but it's actually crack out. And everybody's like, do you know what a crack out means? I'm like, I detect that it's not a good thing no. because the way people look at me. So yeah. yeah, so these are all awkward stories. If you guys want to hear more of these, uh, we'll have guests coming each week. So please subscribe and uh, check it out.